What's going on, everyone? Welcome to the Nikki and Night Show. This is The Scaries, where we take a bunch of scary clips and some fun scary clips. That's what the peeps in the comments are calling it, just around the internet. Before we get into the videos, please make sure you like our videos and subscribe to the channel. It really, really helps. We appreciate the support so far. And without further ado, why are we still talking? Let's get into The Scaries. And for this first episode today, we're going to be blessed with another video of a so-called the Dune D, I believe. I've been corrected many times, so apparently that's how you say it. But look at this creepy little thing. This lady was supposed to be on a smoke break at work, just chilling, hanging out, and all of a sudden she saw this little thing standing back there. I'll play a couple of the other ones just that have been around, and it's not a statue. It looks like it's scratching itself. It's super creepy, but dude... But if you came across one of those and you just saw that thing, just chilling, smoking a Bernie on your lunch break, creepy dude. All right, next clip. What's that? That's not fucking weird, I don't know what it is. And man, this video, I know what you just watched, it is just so eerie. I know it really kind of falls in line with the movie It, you know, with the red balloon floating in the backyard. Here, put a picture of it there. Yeah, that. It's really creepy, dude. This person's obviously outside in the middle of the night, looks like it's some type of like condominium or an apartment complex and just hanging outside with their dog and this freaking balloon is just sitting there floating and sitting there and then eerily just kind of passes by. Don't really know if it means anything. It could just been a balloon that somebody had that just lowered itself there. But dude, that's freaking weird, man. It's like perfectly right in that corridor. Just something that's real creepy and eerie about it. Let us know what you guys would do in that situation. Would you just run over there and just annihilate it? I know, I know my dog would jump over the fence and try to pop it, but you know, that's my dog. But let us know what you guys would do in that situation. Next clip. Where? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. This is a this is definitely a fun one. Just another video of a dude out in the woods videoing. And as you can see, thinks it's something in the background, just sees it and it peeks its head out. This is one of those good old shadow creatures. Don't think that's a Bigfoot. Looks a little bit more like a shadow creature. I've had a couple video of the videos of these come up and they definitely seem to come up a lot more. I don't know what this gentleman was recording on. I don't know if this was like TikTok, Instagram, or if he just like uploaded it to his Facebook or something like that. But that's where we, we're seeing all these creatures. It's super, super creepy. Um, and again, he's out in the middle of freaking nowhere. It obviously looks like it's cold and just get out of there, dude. All right, next clip. Oh my God, what the hell? Why is it wrinkling like that? Somebody's pushing it. Doesn't that look like a piss? Yeah, that's fucking creepy, dude. Hey, Here's a good old paranormal video for you. So in this clip, what it looks like is this person, it just looks like they're laying in bed. I don't think they're like in their living room or anything, but you can see right there. We'll zoom in a little bit as well, but dude, it literally looks like there's a creature's hands or face or something being pushed up against that, the drapes. Even if the window's open, that is a very, very odd way that that would be doing. I don't know if anybody's ever seen curtains flailing. That's really not what it looks like. It looks like something is pressing its face on it. Obviously opens it and there's nothing there. So don't know if this person has had any instances like this happen before. Nothing, there was nothing about it on this video that said that, but any hue, that would be scary. Let us know in the comments what you would think if that was happening with you when you were sitting in your bedroom watching TV, just trying to catch a cool breeze from outside. All right, next clip. And here we apparently have a picture that you just saw of a just a good old fashioned Bigfoot. And this is supposed to be somebody that took a picture of a Bigfoot. It's supposed to be a security guard. This is, uh, we were graced with this picture from our friends over at Boise Bigfoot. Shout out. You guys have great content over there. And I uh, love what you guys are doing. And it's, it's really creepy because it looks like it's just standing there. And I know, again, like everybody says, it looks like it was filmed on a potato. Well, this is a picture 
So, and it does look really grainy, but dude, that does look like some humongous freaking ape-like looking creature that's just standing somewhere in the middle of the night right around a street pole or something like that. I mean, that's creepy as hell. I mean, kudos to the dude that took the picture because I personally, I, I don't know if I would have the wherewithal if, I, if a Bigfoot came out in front of me and tried to take a picture of it. I think I'd be up and out of there. Uh, let us know what you do, what you would do in that situation. Thanks for watching our video this week. We really, really appreciate the support so far. I know it kind of gets redundant after a while, but please make sure that you like our video and subscribe to the channel. It really, really, really helps with the algorithm. And as always, if you want to binge on some videos, head over to the channel and check out our full videos and check out our shorts. There's a bunch of stuff over there. And as always, see you next week.